Klein's pyridinomas are benign, slow-growing skin adnexal tumours derived from the eccrine sweat gland. They tend to occur in young adults, are typically tender and painful, and the commonest site for them to arise is the trunk, although they can also occur occasionally on the scalp, vulva and clitoris. Very rarely, eccrine spiroadenomas may undergo malignant transformation. The gross appearance of an eccrine spiroadenoma is a pink or grey nodule, 1 to 2 cm across, located in the dermis. Histologically, eccrine spiroadenomas are composed of either a lobule or lobules of cells that are well demarcated, situated in the deep dermis or subcutaneous tissue. They are composed of basaloid cells that form either tubules or have an alveolar pattern, and some of the lumina may contain eosinophilic PAS positive material. And another frequent feature is the presence of a lymphoid infiltrate within the lobule of basaloid cells. And here are lobules of basaloid cells that are clearly well demarcated, situated in the lower dermis and also the subcutaneous tissue in the skin biopsy. And when one sees a well demarcated lobule or lobules of cells deep in the dermis with a basaloid appearance, then the diagnosis that springs to mind will be an eccrine spiroadenoma, particularly if the location is correct and the lesion is tender or painful. On higher power it can be seen how well demarcated the lobule of basaloid cells is. And at higher power you can see how the basaloid cells are forming tubules and scattered amongst the basaloid cells are lymphocytes.